Ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to talk about the five things you should never do to your Corvette C8. everyone and welcome back to Brink of Speed. Today I'm bringing you this video about the five nevers, uh, things to not do to your Corvette C8. But before we get into that video, please smash that thumbs up button as this helps break the YouTube algorithm and really helps get my video pushed out all over YouTube. Also, you can help support the channel by clicking that red subscribe and the bell for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Also, ladies and gentlemen, before we get to the video, what I'd like you to do is jot down each of these five reasons that I'm going to give you and let me know if you agree with them or not. And also, let me know if you have more nevers. You can put them down in the comments down below. I'd love to hear what you guys think you should never do to your Corvette C8. All right, let's go ahead and jump into the video. All right, the number one thing you should never do to your Corvette C8 is forget to put down your frunk correctly. Lots of people think they can just take this and drop it, and that's shut. However, it isn't. It's latched one time, but it's not shut correctly. So really, the way that you're supposed to do it is you're supposed to put it down, click it, 
click it again. And with that clicked twice, it will ensure that when you get into your car and you drive off, you have no worries of that front trunk opening up and flying up in your face. Number two, never ever use launch control in manual mode. It revs so fast. When you let off that brake, you're gonna go from 3,500 RPM all the way to red line like that. So there's no need for you to take the risk of you banging off the rev limiter multiple times before you shift to second gear. So please take my advice, always use auto mode when you do a launch control from zero to 60, zero to 30, whatever you're doing, zero to 100, use it in auto mode. Number three, never take your car through a car wash that has the rails that go on either side of your tires. Now, if you go to a touchless wash where there are no rails, that's fine. But as soon as you start trying to put, not your front tire, but your really wide rear tires into those rails, you're gonna have major issues. It's gonna scratch your wheels, or even worse, it could dent your wheels. It could warp your tire, because they're not gonna fit into those rails at all. So either take your car, to a touchless wash that has no rails or wash it at home. Number four is never park your C8 Corvette without using your front cameras. Now, obviously, if you don't have a 2LT or above with the front cameras on the bumper, then you would probably want to do a reverse park because you're gonna have the backup camera, so you'll be able to see with that. But if you have a 2LT or above, always, always use your front camera to make certain that you don't smash the front of your bumper or your splitter on the curb. And number five, never put less than 91 or 93 octane in your Corvette C8. GM recommends that you use the highest octane out there, not racing gas or anything like that, but 91 or 93. I don't think there's any states out there, you can let me know in the comments down below, I don't think there's any cities or states out there that have less than 91 for their premium. So just make sure that you put premium 91 or 93 in your C8 Corvette at all times, and I highly recommend Shell Gas over all other gas stations. They've proven through science, through uh, technology, that they have the cleanest and safest gas out of all the companies. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so that is gonna wrap this video up. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. Leave me comments down below, like I said in the beginning, and let me know what you think are the things that you should never do to your Corvette C8. And if you have not joined this wonderful Brink of Speed community, I'd love to have you. Please hit that red subscribe and the bell for notifications when new videos are uploaded. I hope everyone has a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you out on the road.